My name is Helen Burridge. I am a Community Engagement Officer at St Albans City and District Council. The objectives of community service, there, there is no one single objective. It's one of the most diverse departments in the council. So it's making sure people's bins get collected on time and that we recycle as much as we possibly can as a district. It's making sure that the grass is mown in the parks, looking after the playgrounds and making sure that the buildings that the council owns are well maintained and making sure that the events that we run are smooth and safe. I'm Daniel Flitton and I'm the Principal Green Space Officer. Parks and Green Spaces, we look after the cemeteries, the parks, the allotments. Um, my role specifically is managing the grounds maintenance contract uh, and looking after specific open spaces. On a day-to-day -day basis, I deal with the customer service side of things, so dealing with the customer inquiries, picking up calls, looking into issues. On a busy day, you might have three, 4,000 people using the Smash Park and the logistics of making sure that's cleared up is difficult because you need lots of manpower. It has its challenges and we have really tough days sometimes but we have a working environment where actually we really support each other. There's been a market on St Peter Street for over 500 years. The market forms the background of the community, it forms the backbone of the events that we do on St Peter Street. We are combining the launch of the Christmas market with the Christmas light switch on. There are over 15,000 people on St Peter Street. We've got panto stars, we have a stage with musical programming, we have flashing lights. Last year we had a giant snow globe that people could walk in and have their photograph taken. I also uh, manage Verilanian Park. There's lots of different things we do there. It's, it's got crazy golf, it's got children's play area, we have beach volleyball courts, a children's splash park, and it's a 56 acre park. So it's, you know, from the grounds maintenance perspective, there's a lot going on there. Um, and we have hundreds of thousands of visitors every year. So working with the park ranging team, we, we kind of just make sure that the park is as beautiful as we can make it for the visitors. You've got to have good personal skills, you've got to be able to talk to people, you've got to be able to empathise. So it's just really recognising how to handle that particular person um, by kind of gauging how they're responding to what you're saying and what they're saying. When you're working within the council, you're able to see that there are enthusiastic people who are all care deeply about what they're doing and they have a reason for what they're doing and they're working hard for the greater good rather than standing outside and saying the council. You can be within the council doing something fabulous. The staff are interested and interesting. I've always said that, you know, I have to enjoy where I'm working. I have to like the people. They're like family, actually. 